The Alamana Center focuses on building peace, trust and reconciliation between and within religions. Oman became the center, call it fate, destiny, providence, because we had a history there. So the Reformed Church in America started the mission there in 1892, and it developed education and healthcare, really pioneered healthcare in the country. And throughout the history of doing those works was this history of interfaith cooperation, because it was Christians and Muslims and Hindus and Buddhists and people from around the world who happened to be there who came together to do these things. What the Alamana Center does is it puts you in relationship with people who believe differently than you, look differently than you, and it gives you the incubator to try out questions, try out relationships, in order to be formed to bring about goodness in a new world. You know, that's why I love bringing Westerners, people from America there to, to meet my Muslim friends so that they can go, wow, you're nothing like ISIS. You're nothing like Al-Qaeda. You're nothing like what I, I see on the news. Um, and so that they too can then go back to their, their context here. And when people say, well, Muslims are all out to kill me, they can say, well, no, let me tell you about the Muslim that was all out to feed me. I think what makes the Alamana Center unique is the way they go about doing interfaith dialogue and peace reconciliation. They believe very strongly in personal relationships, in building friendships, so that deeper dialogue can happen. Uh, we're not going to solve the world's problems, but at least we can be a, a beacon of hope. A beacon of, uh, of hope that it's possible for religion not to divide but for the people, faithful people of, of religions, living together is not a myth, it's not a dream. Please come and visit us. We would love to share our experiences with you. Ahan wa sahlan, welcome in Arabic. You are always welcome to Alamana Center in the Sultanate of Oman.